This is a typical formed up bronze style and rail type door construction. This is where the metal is the structure of the door. The minimum style width is two and three quarter. The bottom rail minimum is six inches. You got formed up glass stops that can accommodate anywhere from one quarter inch glass up to one inch insulated glass. But because this is a formed up door, if you do have to accommodate or have the need to accommodate even thicker glasses, say bullet resistant or maybe even blast mitigation glass, the door can be made thicker to accommodate that because it's formed up. The secret to this kind of door construction is what's called a tie channel subassembly. What you're seeing here is this little U-shaped portion inside, and that's the tie channel that goes all the way around the vision opening. And it's a subassembly of channels that are welded in the corners, and then you slide that between the skins of the door and position it, and then it's spot welded or resistance welded right into place. In other words, and that's a key, that it's true automotive type spot welding and not sort of tack welding it on the edge. And it's that spot welding or that resistance welding that really gives the door its strength. This is the actual door corner sample right here. Okay, what you've also got is not only this tie channel that we talked about that goes around the vision area and it's spot welded at very close intervals every three inches or so, but also there's a, a bottom channel and a top channel that's also slid into place and that's also spot welded into place. It's kind of difficult to see but there's these little dimples here at close intervals. Those are the spot welds and they're a resistance weld right through the face of the door and that fuses the metal together and that once you have all this metal fused together it makes for a very strong rigid durable door construction. A lot stronger than if you were going to just sort of tack weld this together or if you're going to take thinner materials and clad it over aluminum. This material here is a minimum of 09 inch thick, 3 30 seconds thick, the heaviest that you usually will see in typical door construction. Both the external parts and the internal parts are all 09 inch thick minimum, and they're all made up of the same material. In other words, a bronze door has bronze internal parts. If this were stainless, it would be stainless, both internal and external parts. Again, spot welded together to give strength.